Hi guys, my name is Lorena. I'm one of the co-founders of Blogettes and a couple of months ago I became a mom. So I am back at the office and today I wanted to share with you some tips that have helped me maintain some sort of work-life balance while being a new mom. So tip number one, guys, schedule everything. And when I say everything, I mean everything from your email time to personal time to even if you want to go get a manicure, put it on your calendar so you actually do it. Putting everything on your calendar allows for you to really plan every single activity. It will prevent you from canceling things or getting too stressed out, feeling annoyed. Like actually since I started putting everything on my calendar, I know that I still have so much to do, but at least I feel that I accomplished what I wanted for that day and that makes me feel really good and less stressed at the end of the day. Tip two, delegate. I think all of us working moms, especially all of us that own our own business, it's so hard to ask for help and it's so hard because we're I am a control freak so it's very hard also to delegate. I want to take care of everything as I'm sure it happens to most of you. Um, I want to do everything, I want to do everything on my own but I've really had to learn over this past couple of months to accept help and also learn to delegate because if not things here at work will not happen so it's worse if they don't happen than having somebody else do it so learn to accept that you can do everything and learn to delegate tip number three don't overcommit you guys i think nowadays again we want to do everything and i am the queen of overcommitting to stuff and i started noticing that i was canceling on a bunch of things so it's better to tell someone that you can meet with them next week then tell them you can meet with them tomorrow or take a phone call today and you having to cancel because you're actually having such a crazy day so give yourself some time do not overcommit, and again schedule everything tip number four and final tip for the video uh, wake up earlier than you're used to wake up at least 45 minutes before your normal time to wake up because you can take those 45 minutes to catch up on urgent emails um, catch up on a phone call whatever it is that you need to do before your baby actually wakes up like I know Diego wakes up at 7 so I'm already ready at 6 so I can take that hour to focus on myself and then when he wakes up I can give him full attention for two hours before I come to the office and I don't come to the office as stressed out because I already took care of my email I already took care of the urgent stuff and I'm ready to start my day so hopefully these tips are helpful for you. I know they have helped me so far. I know I still have a long way to go to achieve perfect balance if there's such a thing. But thank you so much for being part of this video. Hopefully you liked it. Give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our blog at YouTube channel. Thank you so much guys. Bye!